Hey guys, it's Rachel. What's up with you today? Special stream week continues. Okay guys, so now it's time to check out some more uh, teas. And I'm so excited for this. Literally the outfit is inspired by the stray kids and a tea sort of dark side so from the start of me reacting to k-pop you guys blow up my comment section talking about how incredible a tease is all the time they are performers see this is what so many of you guys are talking about because i've obviously checked out their music videos <laughs> Bye. i'm in love I'm dreaming a dream every day. That harmony is so beautiful. What we're going to be checking out today from a tease is number one is going to be Halla Halla. And then two is going to be a tease's answer. And then three, we're going for Wonderland. And four, we're checking out their new song, Deja Vu. And I am so excited for all of these. The first time I reacted to BTS, I had so many people. Oh, don't you know K-pop already? Your intro is a tease? And I was like, okay, here we go. I literally heard the part that sounds like my intro and it's insane the fact that it's like the doo -doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. like the snippet that i have is from an artist i know called tourist true hippie look for me if your man ain't putting work pull that thing down and reverse then i you see this this is literally called look for me and i have it from there like this is my intro. This was literally like, it's honestly fate. The fact that I chose a snippet of a song that literally I just heard and I absolutely love. Used it for my entire intro to YouTube. And it's the same as a K-pop song. Like I was just made to love K-pop. Anyways guys, I am so excited to hear the full song of Hala Hala. I wanna know exactly how they use the beat, what that sort of vibe is, and I am ready for it. Hey guys, time to Hala Hala it up. Guys, we're here for a teases Hala Hala. Hearts awakened, live alive. Oh my gosh, that is already so interesting. Hearts awakened, live while you're already alive? Holla holla. Let's go. I'm so excited to hear the tune. Mm. Oh, I want a mask like that. Mm, this is dark, I like. The red is nice. Hey! Yeah! Oh my god. I love it already. going to be auto generated guys so i'm sorry if it's not like the perfect definition of what they're actually saying but anyways guys i love the sound already it's a really beautiful instrumental Oh! Did you hear the way 
why he was like flashing lights oh my gosh they're really intense aren't they even the way that they came in i was like oh my gosh a tease are the main attraction like they're the full-on performers like you'd think here that this is going to be like a little dance performance but it's actually the artist okay i need to get into these vocals again okay i'm gonna look at the lyrics after just because they're a little bit distracting because they're not the full definition Dancing, I love the way the do 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 is intertwined, guys. Guys, you know how I like my dancing. I'm sorry, is this, is this Mingi? Correct me if I'm wrong and I apologise to every single a tiny if I'm wrong. But I don't know, just that vibe, the way he came through, like... But guys, this is all so intense and this is, it looks like a one-shot view that they've done and they're getting everything so perfectly. I love how it's in like a lot of an abandoned warehouse type of vibe. Let's go. Oh 
my golly gracious me. In that sense, like I don't even know what to do with myself apart from like bop my head and keep my mouth open. I was literally just about to say that a tease are so intense and they're so confident like there is just something about the way that they move and do their moves they know that they are fire and very very like almost intimidating with how powerful they are do you know what i mean like there is just something about their energy that is like whoa take a step back and just be like oh my gosh i'm sorry i'm in your presence you know it's like, please, bow down. Like, holy moly, that was incredible. And I love the way they did the do 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 with the do 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 beat in the background. I cannot. I love how intense all of their moves are. And it was also really interesting that they all had masks and ha um, hats on. So I didn't know who either of them were at all. So I got to see all of their talents without like focusing on someone that really interests me if you know what i mean and then when their hats came off and they came through with that final performance that was just and insane it's like those beautiful moves that actually make me go crazy like it reminds me of when like in fire when shugi's like when he's doing that little move with his head when he's like being drunk but i love these like erratic hard hitting moves just something about it that actually takes my breath away that this little this little chew cannot handle Yes, erratic, ridiculous. It's like, oh, in your face. You actually just want to bow down or you feel like you're about to pass out. I don't even know. <laughs> I just want to check out the lyrics for Hala Hala. Deep in my heart, deep in my soul, coming to that flashing light. Ooh, bit hotter. Suicide Squad, the reality. Oh, I got that erratic sort of vibe from that, you know? The lyrics are very short and like erratic. As I said, like the way that they just keep changing in and out of different things that they're saying. I love that. God putting me in this scene just like an assassin. <gasps> okay. Right guys, so the next song that we are gonna be checking out is a tease answer. As there are no subtitles on the actual music video, I'm gonna check out what it's about first. Let's make a toast like a fun. Raise your glasses over your heads as high as they can be seen anywhere. I got the answer. Ooh. A lot of this is talking about raising your glass and facing each other. It's almost like cheersing to something because they know the answer. So they're like celebrating something. And then we go burn, burn, burn it up. They love fire. Every day's a finale show. <gasps> It's, it's almost saying like every day is your last, but in a more epic K-pop way. Young and free, we hiss at the world, brighten ourselves in the dark with no answer. Ooh, when they have no answer in the dark, they brighten themselves because they have the answer. Oh, oh, okay, okay. I'm ready, I'm, I'm ready for this vibe. They sure do use a lot of metaphors. They are so passionate. Ooh. Okay, guys. Are you ready for a teaser's answer? Let's go. Already building a story. 
지 Oh my gosh! It's Mingi. Is this Mingi with this boy's hair? I absolutely adore his voice and vibe. It's incredible. But wow, I love the sound of this song already. I don't know, just from like all of their old songs, I was expecting something really like intense. But as soon as the instrumental started with that beautiful piano, I was like, oh my gosh, this might be more of a, like an emotional song. Oh, I love this. And I feel like this is the person who literally sung incredibly well in Halla Halla just then. But look at this scene with all the sheets. It's almost like you're in bed and like that is the moon shining there. I love this, guys. I love the sound of this already. The piano starts, it stops, and the song. God, I'm, I'm in love with Mingi. I'm in love with Mingi. I cannot deal when he comes through and he's just like, amazing. But guys, look at Wu Young. I just know from Soupy. But oh my goodness, the scenes in this are really beautiful. It just constantly looks like they're longing and looking for the answer. Oh, I love that we read the lyrics first. Like, this has such deep meaning towards it. And I can't, the suits and everything is beautiful. Do you know what it is? With a tease, every single person has a really strong, powerful voice. Like, every time someone new comes in, you can hear that it's someone different. And I love that. All the tones coming together as one, as a group, is just like a beautiful harmony. I'm loving this. I'm loving it. I love the way this slows down. I 
I love this guy's voice. I'm not even going to try and imitate that beautiful whistling in the background. Who did that? <laughs> there are so many different tones. Every time someone new comes on, I'm like, oh, I love his voice. I love his voice. This, blah, 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 blah. this is actually insane, guys. I really, really like this. I love listening to so many different songs from groups and then when you hear their like emotional songs this really brings out their talents <laughs> That's a beautiful shot. Ooh, answer. Oh my god, I love how it's slanted like that because it makes you go, answer, like, what's the answer? I loved answer. Oh my goodness, I feel like sometimes, you know, when you like hear a K-pop song, you know which ones that you're going to listen to a lot and the hip thrusts, they do hip thrusts and everything. Like I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. An answer is really nice. I feel like I'm going to listen to that a lot because I love a good sing-along song. But it was beautiful. There were so many different tones in there. I think this is the first song, because I haven't checked out many from a tease already, but this is the first song where I really got to hear so many of their like unique vocals. And I'm sorry, Mingi is actually gonna be the death of me. If he comes through again with that, with that voice, I'm actually, my head's gonna fall on the floor. San is very expressive in the way he dances. I love his like contemporary vibe that he has in little things. Like stuff like this, burn, burn, burn it up more, keep going, make a fire, every day's a finale show, as like tomorrow is the end of the world. It gives me a completely different insight, like before I thought maybe it's going to be quite upbeat, like yeah it's the end of the world, that sort of darkish vibe. But now it's more like, you know, every day could be our last, you never know when the world is gonna end. So it's like, live it, live it like it's your last. I don't know, it gives me a completely different like feeling towards the lyrics and everything now. And I, oh, I really, really enjoyed that song, guys. I can't wait to hear that live. But anyways, guys, the next song that we're gonna be checking out is a tease Wonderland. It already just makes your imagination go to so many places. Like what I can see right now for Wonderland is like a carnival sort of like fairy tale vibe. But because it's a Wonderland, it's almost like not real. So it's like a candy land. But I guess we're gonna have to see. 
Anyways, guys, we are here for a teaser's wonderland. Let's go. Forever child like Peter, literally like Peter Pan. Oh my gosh. Wonderland. Wow. Island of dream and fear of all the hearts. Oh my God. Of course, a tease would put that together. An island of dreams and fear of all the hearts. They love to be intimidating and intense. I love it. But these suits right here. We all love a man in uniform. Why did I literally feel like I was walking into the gates of hell? Like, I am the ruler! Oh my! Oh my goodness, I, I, I'm in love with the dark vibes that they have. That, oh mama word, that just sounds like they're literally conjuring up power. <coughs> Holy moly. Holy moly. They, they make me feel so many emotions that I'm just like getting hit in the face with. It's incredible. I love the sound of this, guys. I'm not ready for this girl. I'm not ready for this. This is so cheeky. Oh, mama way. It's like a little sneaking sound there. And the way I know that's Wu Young because of Soupy. But wow, I love that scene there. They're literally like in chains. Almost like they're stuck 
in this childlike state and they don't want to get out of it. I love all of the references that they have to Peter Pan and stuff like that. They said something about staying high like Jack Sparrow, something like that. And I love all the references they have to this. They have the marching bands here. They have little like homages to like the carnival type of vibes keeping us all in this child state and never ever wanting to leave our childhood oh this is this is dark i like give me to be <laughs> be like all hell a tease oh my gosh that 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 end part i love how they always like at the end they seem to like almost push someone out of the way come into the middle and come through with some like intense little dance break it's it's just it's just really intense guys i really like it <laughs> Like, they just hold so much power. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Now, do you know what's going to be stuck in my head? Oh, mama, where? Oh, mama, where? I'm sorry, but I just kind of want to go back to the full dance break at the end because it kind of made me feel a type of way. Yeah, that bit, like, where they're both facing each other and they're like, they have so many, like, movements there where they're going crazy and it's just so intense to watch and it's, uh, it literally makes, it makes my heart flutter. understand the hype for a tease like i'm literally watching it and there is stuff that is going on in my head that is like i'm gonna be a big fan 
I'm gonna be a big, big fan. Like, I'm just watching like little parts and I'm like, oh, it's doing things to me, guys. That had such an a tease vibe to it. Like, I always said to you guys that I felt like a tease had more of like a darker, sort of like intense vibe. And that literally sounded like I was walking to the gates of hell, but I was the ruler of it, you know? I literally ruled the entire thing and I was walking down with my cane like oh mama way like oh it made me feel a type of way guys all the scenes with the chains like chain 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 I actually can't guys the last one that we're gonna be checking out is a teaser's deja vu I'm ready for this you're not ready yeah, to be honest, I'm not ready, but I'm ready. I'm not ready, but it's gonna happen anyway. Okay. Oh guys, why are you saying you're not ready? This is like when you told me I wasn't ready for Red Lights by Stray Kids. <laughs> are you ready, kids? Let's go for a teaser's deja vu. Oh, I like the start already. I'm probably going to fade in the next verse, but you can just hear already by the vocals that this is going to be seductive. The way he came through. Dun, 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 dun. I can't, guys. This is almost too much for me already, and it's just happened. I love the blue vibes they're giving us, but look, are you in front of my eyes? A dream? Oh my gosh, there was one line as well. I'm thirsted by desire. That is all of us watching right now. Thirsted by the desire of K-pop. Very cheeky. Oh. that they moved for the da 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 oh i know you get deja vu <laughs> look at the way that they move for that 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 dance move oh oh my gosh <laughs>
how to make us have an endless thirst. They bring us these incredible outfits with like these tight leather outfits with these incredible bluish tones everywhere. The cars, like don't you bring us the leather and cars? Stop, but I love that. I know you get deja vu, the way they sing that bit. Oh my gosh, look at the visuals. The lighting on the skin is insane. Feels as if I just had a dream in a dream. I feel you. place right now the way that Mingi's voice came out there is find you in my heart the cheeky da, 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 da. I generally need a moment but I swear as I said every single end scene dance movement is incredible by a tease and it's raining it's raining I'll find you in my heart fever part three i'm sorry guys i just need to i just need to i need to hear the start of that i know you get deja vu and this bit at the end when they come through with the dance break in the rain <laughs> Mingi is but I can just tell he's tall but honestly the way he just like comes through with this like energy as if he's like been possessed is just amazing <laughs> Oh, 
how tall Mingi is 183 centimeters. Let me just Google what that is in feet. Six foot. All right, let's not, let's not be too thirsty tonight. I am gonna be listening to that so many times. I love the visuals that they had throughout the music video of this like blue tone this entire time. Like, oh my gosh, and the outfits and the dancing. Did you see that flow? How he was just like, with those legs. Oh my gosh, and they literally bring like femininity masks. They're like, da, 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 uh, uh. I actually can't handle that. Like, that was just incredible. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for being here. I will see you later. But anyways, tune in next time.